teaching you how to live a better life every day of the week, month, and year. CampingGearTV.com. I'm Josh. I'm Ben. We have Gary with us today, really rounding out our crew, and He's we're looking at a sleeping bag. Gary's with us most days, isn't yep. he? Yeah. Yeah. Rounding it out. That's true. Yeah. Yeah, we are looking at a sleeping bag. Let me uh, kind of do a little twirl here. Do it a little slower. Not just being in this thing because it's actually a pretty warm sleeping bag. Yeah. We're taking a look at a product. Hot. Yeah. Like sexy hot. Right. Yeah. Hell yeah, dog. We're uh, taking a look at a product from Sierra Designs. Yes. And we look at some stuff for, from them in the past. Yeah. But not a sleeping bag. And this is, I'm going to say, this is one of the better sleeping bags we've looked at. This is their Pyro 15. 15 being that it's a 15 degree rated sleeping bag. Mm -hmm. And, you know, sometimes, you know, sleeping bags, it's like, okay, they're, you know, they're pretty much what they are. But this one has some pretty neat features that I think that differentiates it a little bit from some other products that are out there on the market that we're going to talk about. They are who we thought they were. <laughs> they are who we thought they were. Okay. Dennis so, Green. Right. <clears throat> Famous NFL blow up. Yes. Okay. Well, so, yes. uh, the first thing we should maybe talk about on this bag is orange they, actually that is what we're going to talk about cool because the orange is what is called their core comfort technology cct so when i stand up you can see what would uh you know core meaning you know your chest area of your body your core yeah and that's where the orange is is mainly located and what the orange is is it's concentrate it's concentrated pockets of fill yeah so that it's keeping my core temperature up, which is the most important part of my body to keep warm while awesome. I'm sleeping. That's very neat. So, so instead of having it... Makes sense. Yeah, so, I mean, in, in, instead of having it, you know, distribute it in the places where you don't need as much to keep you warm, right. they're piling up down over on your core. This is 600 fill, powder down. Pretty pa good. Power down. Synthetic? No, goose. Oh, really? Yes. Gonna last a little longer. 30D polyester micro ripstop, 30D po or for uh, the shell material and the liner material is yeah. 30D polyester as well. Yeah. The size I have is the regular, and people are gonna ask, so I'm gonna kind of go through and quote these uh, these sizes here. Sounds it fits good. the six foot. Okay, it's 78 inches in length. Its shoulder girth is 62 inches. Hip girth 58 inches. Foot box 40 inches. And this is the nice bit. Its total weight is two pounds. 13 ounces. Hmm. I find this to be a pretty compact sleeping bag for yeah. a 15 degree sleeping bag. So as you can see, it's a, it's a mummy sleeping bag. You, you stuck? I am stuck. Actually, I'm going to be honest, I never had this problem before with the zipper. The zipper is actually pretty good on this bag, I think. So it that, looks like you got the fabric caught in it. You might want to pull it back the other way. See what I'm saying? Yeah, I do. We got a little bit of an issue on our hands here. How terrible is that? So, I use this. For, I never got down the, into teen digits, mm -hmm. but getting down to low 30s, high 20s, this bag performs really, really well. There's yeah. a lot of people who talk about, you know, you're going to want to give yourself some headroom as far as temperature ratings are concerned on sleeping bags. Yeah. I believe it's seen around the internet. This bag is very well reviewed. Every site, everywhere. Nice. And uh, let me think here. There's some awards that it won too. Do 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 do. Camping Life Golden Stake Editor's Choice Award and Elevation Outdoors Editor's Choice Award. Interesting. So, and I, again, I just think you know that the compactability for the weight, yeah. for the temperature ratio, very, very warm, very, very comfortable. You know, you're getting into the freezing temperature range, right? And into the low 30s, high 20s. This bag is going to perform great. Like I say, people a lot of times think you should give yourself some headroom if you're going to be sleeping in 20 degree weather, or if you're going to be sleeping in say like 30 degree weather buy a 15 or 20 degree rated bag. Always buy so that you're giving yourself some yeah. space. Yeah. You know, if, if, if you're going to be sleeping in 10 degree mm -hmm. weather, buying a 10 degree sleeping bag, you might be cutting it close. Well, you survive. You will, oh, you'll you're not comfortable. Yeah, you'll definitely survive. This has the EN 
temperature rating system that we've yeah. talked about in the past, comfort limit, or comfort limit, lower limit, extreme limit, respectively, those are 25, 12, and 22. Oh. So 20, or sorry, minus 22 degrees Fahrenheit. So you're going to be able to survive in some pretty serious temperatures in this bag. I myself would never want to take this bag into that, but just in case I got caught in trouble, I, I, you know, at least you know it's there and it works. Awesome. This includes a storage sack. Unfortunately, because we got a sales sample, we just got, or uh, a stuff sack is what we didn't get. We got the storage sack, we did not get the stuff sack. Compression. So I had to use my own compression sack, which just worked totally fine in and compacted really, really easily. But if you buy one, you're going to get a sack. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Compress it up nice and tight. It has tight little package. It has sleeping pad locks on the back, you know, where I can, like, get my sleeping bag in here to... Oh, that's what that Or, is. I mean, sleeping pad in here to yeah. tighten it. Nice. Yep. That is cool. And then... Yeah, so you're not... Yeah, you know, it's always staying with you. I like... On the back here, I have this little pocket for a pillow. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And, and so I think that's actually really great, like really that. important because no, that is neat. sometimes when you're camping, you're not bringing the biggest pillow with you. Yeah. So you got a small pillow, and you could end up, you know, on the other side of your tent, you know, without a pillow if, if you're moving around a lot. Very attractive sleeping bag. All right. Lots of really nice features. I mean, that uh, that sleeping pad strap thing is really cool. I think that 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 core technology that's innovative yeah it's and it's I'm, really neat so you're keeping the weight down you're not adding fill in areas where it's not totally right. necessary and so it's not like keeping the, the price down a little bit right it's not like this area is doesn't have fill in it I right mean, it has it's fill in it less. but in the core area i mean they really right. packed a ton in there so that the majority yeah. of the heat is staying where it should and it makes for just a really really comfortable sleep and it feels like the the this area where you know the, where you're sleeping, there's just you know it's a lot of padding there, and I can roll around, and it's just you know yeah I'm very very comfortable in, in in colder temperatures, so that's really really great. It's got a draft collar on it. Let's see anything else. Clearly, it's a mummy bag, like we talked about. Do 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 do. Ergonomic hood, draw cord at the collar. I think that pretty much covers it. Boom. I, I believe you can, find right this, your hands. you can find this on the internet for about $250 here and there. $249. You see what I did there a second ago? You smacked it down. Yeah. Smacked it downtown. So I, I actually really like this bag a lot. and thought, thought it performed well. Me One too. of the better bags I've slept in. Super, super warm. I think worth every single penny. Yeah, absolutely. This would be a great bag I'd be looking into if... I was sure I was never going to be in zero degree weather yeah. or single digit weather. Yeah. I'm not a bit, we've camped in that weather before. Yeah. Sometimes it sucks, yeah, to be honest. Nice. It can get cold. It can. That, that kind of business is just not for me. I need to be a little bit warmer. Not for this day. So if, if that's who you are, this is a great sleeping bag where you can get this for colder temperatures right. and keep another warm. Uh, sleeping bag and you got yourself two sleeping bags that are going to do yourself just fine. Pretty sweet. Yeah, I like to get to the point where I guess I have three sleeping systems. Uh, really? Yeah, and my my third one being a summertime really, really light Yeah. when it's warm. So I wouldn't even call it a sleeping bag. You know, you have a lot of times where you have liners or even kind of like sheet systems yeah. that's not really a bag. I have one I have one sleeping system that I use all the time. Yeah. You know what, you know what I call it? What? Butt naked. Oh, dang. Oh, dang. In your bed? Anywhere. Yeah. Yeah. Like even if I'm like out drinking and I have to sleep on someone's couch or something. Right. I'm gonna tell you that's how the good Lord made you and you should never be ashamed. Right. You know, how whatever position you wake up in. Yeah. I mean I could go on and on about it, but I won't. Yeah. I think the bag is sexy. Head over to Sierra Designs. Dot com is that you know I didn't write down their website. Something happened to your paper. Yeah. Uh, Otherwise you'd know. But. Right. I think I, SierraDesigns.com obviously will have a link. Check out their gear because they got a ton of awesome stuff over there. We looked at a jacket from them earlier. That's the product we looked at before. Yeah. They have everything over there from you know apparel, sleeping bags, tons of great stuff. Tents. Tents. Oh, yeah. Oh, right. Oh, right. 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 They're, they're technical stuff. Yeah. They're one of those companies who's kind of like jack of all trades. But master of them as well, I believe. Yes, they constantly win awards. Right, they really do. 
their stuff is always winning awards for really being right on the edge of new innovations. Right, and a lot of times we're we're going on and we're researching our gear ourselves. We're also seeing what other people are saying about this. Yeah. And I'm I'm being dead serious. I was having trouble finding one bad thing written about the bag. Going to all the sites, performing really, really well, lots of five-star ratings, tons of people saying really, really great stuff about sure, it. Sure, of course. I just think it's really, really good. Yeah, for sure, it's, man. For especially sure. for their comfort technology in here. I mean, I just think that's smart. It just makes sense. Yeah. Keep, all, keep you know a lot of fill around your your core area. It keeps you keeps you warm. Do you think I could fit this in my mouth? He's Josh. He's Gary. I'm Ben. We're CampingGearTV.com.